Hey guys, if you do fancy any coins, then check out GameGoldTrader.com. Use Cal Freezy at checkout. You will grab yourself a 10% discount. And also, if you want to sell your coins to them, you can also go ahead and do that. So check out the site. I'll leave links all down below. And uh, yeah, enjoy the video, guys. Bring on FIFA 15. What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome to this FIFA 15 news, hallelujah, we all love FIFA 15 news guys and today EA released some information and you guys can expect so much more FIFA 15 information to be released over this coming week because EA are at Gamescom and this is when they start to talk about ultimate team clubs, all that sort of thing, it all tends to revolve around Gamescom so expect plenty of more of these videos and uh, if you like them please do leave a like, let me know um, if you guys enjoyed these FIFA 15 videos but Today, we're here to talk about what EA have just released on their Twitter and on their website, and it is all about team management. Hallelujah! They have changed team management. What a beautiful site this is. Look how nice this looks compared to our previous team management, which, to be honest with you guys, was an utter mess. It had been like that for so long, they really needed to update it, and it looks like they've finally taken matters into their own hands and changed things up. Hopefully, it's not as laggy. We all remember, or we all still know how laggy and just sluggish the team management feels. So, anyways, let's talk about what they've done. Now, you can have up to six different team sheets per club so that you can have your team playing whatever way you want them to play. So, what they mean by t uh, six team sheets is that you're going to be able to have, you know, whether you want to have a counter-attacking side or, you know, maybe a super defensive uh, way you want your team to play. You can have all of these things sort of saved the way you want to be able to play with that team if that makes sense so hopefully that's okay now one thing to keep in mind guys is ultimate team fans you, you might want to close your ears for this one it's not going to sound too pretty but this team management is only available on career mode kickoff or match day whichever one you want to call it online friendlies and tournaments there is no ultimate team uh, th this isn't on ultimate team which is a real blow you know it would have been awesome to have this on ultimate team and I really hope they still change the team management for ultimate team because if I'm honest with you I just don't like the way team management is right now and I'd love to be able to customize my team a whole lot more than what I'm able to do right now but you guys can see on these screenshots you know they have some really cool stuff going on and as you can see on your screen right now you're able to change the roles of the players who your free kick taker is who your captain is and you can actually set these to to your default so Instead of having to, every time you would play play with Barcelona, you have to change Messi to be the left short free kick taker. You can actually set that as a default, so he will always be that, and you don't have to constantly change it. So, hopefully that's uh, kind of uh, cleared that up for you guys, and uh, made a little bit of sense. But what you can also do, is you can actually manage the attacking runs and the defensive positions of the players. So, you know, if I want Busquets to sit a lot deeper than what he's currently sitting at right now, then I can make that happen if I want Messi to make a different type of role then that can happen as you can see there's little tabs on the top you have squad formations roles and this bits obviously on the roles right now and uh, you can see it comes up with stats so you can make the best decision based on their stats um you also have instructions and that's where you're going to find these attacking runs you know if you want to tell a player um do it this way do it that way you can make sure that happens and here you can see is the squad page now this is really cool I love that little uh, graphic at the top um I, I there's probably a uh, a, a correct word a term for it but uh it's that circle with the, the the weird shapes inside which shows how good they are at pace shooting passing dribbling i really like the look of that that's cool and as you can see you can make the substitutes on the bottom so overall i'm really happy with what ea have done with this because let's be honest guys this has been a long time coming this team management it needed to be updated and i'm so glad that they finally done it in fifa 15 on the next gen consoles too it should look fantastic so um, another thing is you can have up to five attacking and defending player instructions applied to each player out there. So hopefully uh, that makes a little bit of sense to you guys. So um, the instructions of the attacking runs, uh, you know, what you, whether you want them to sit deeper, um, all that. So just instructions to your player. You can have up to five per player on the field. So that's pretty awesome. And what you're looking at right now is the tactics. You can uh, change the speed. You know, do you want it to be really fast? Of course, Barcelona play that fast. Uh, Tiki Taka sort of football and uh, yeah as you can see their crossing is pretty low all that sort of stuff so you can get really in depth you can really customize what the way you want your team to play and that's what I think is so cool about it and then again here is some more tactics you can have the default Barcelona one counter attacking high pressure possession long ball and then even your own custom tactics so hopefully you guys uh, have liked this video hopefully um, you've kind of learned something new I'll uh, do my best and try and remind myself to leave the link um, to more information 
information on all of these uh, team management sort of stuff in the description. But um, yeah, I think this is a positive change. You know, it's not super big, but it is just a positive. It's a, it's a move in the right direction. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hope you all enjoyed this video and don't forget to leave a like. Bye-bye.